Y'all, I seriously think this hat is meant for kids because why is it buckling up like this and it feels tight? It's all get out. Anyway, hi y'all. Happy day seven of Vlogtober. We are on our way to Tarjay. <laughs> Per use. Actually, this time though, I'm taking something back, but I'm gonna use that credit to purchase something else. Amen. All right. Um, that jacket that y'all saw me buy, this one, the green jacket, I put it in a full line bag because I don't have a Target bag. But baby, listen, they'll be all right. I didn't wear it. It was fifty-five dollars, so I'm about to take it back and then use it today because I am going to the Kevin Gates concert tonight. So I'm gonna wear my green jumpsuit outfit that I was gonna wear in Atlanta, but I couldn't wear in Atlanta because the grandmas ain't go out, <laughs> okay? And I need a red lip, which remember, no, I think I cut it out the vlog because it was unnecessary. I told y'all that, I, I think I mentioned it, I don't know. I did tell y'all that, that I was trying to go to the girl Anaya Visa store to get her red lip kit but she was closed. So now I'm about to just go into Target and y'all know Target now sells Ulta products. So they have Mac in there and I really like how Ruby Woo, Ruby Woo looks on me. So I'm gonna get Ruby Woo and then I am going to get a brown lip liner. And I don't know, I, that shouldn't equate to $55. So we gonna see what else we can get while we land. Um, also, y'all, my dad on radio and my car went out, so I can't listen to music, can't listen to the radio, can't talk on my Bluetooth, can't do any of that. So tomorrow, I'm going to try to see if it can be fixed. Hopefully, it's just a fuse issue. I did look on YouTube, and somebody was saying that it was like, if you just change the fuse, it should start working again. If it don't start working because the fuse, I'm going to be sad, because like, who wants to drive around in the car and you can't play no music? Like, it's one thing not having bluetooth connection or aux but it's another thing when you can't even listen to the radio i can't even listen to the radio like nah that's just we, we uh -uh. hopefully it could just be fixed with that but you know y'all every single time something happened what that made me say it's time for a new car it's time for a new car so anyway i got a headache already from this hat do y'all see how it's buckled up like what the f i know my hair not that big I know it's not. Is it? So I did my return. I got my little gift card. Oh, wait, is this the lipstick? Oh, I think this is the lip liner. Oh, tell me they don't have it. Oh, it's up here. Okay, here we go. Okay. Yeah. I need a lip liner, but I'm gonna just do this. Yeah, like the ones that they have in size, they have um, they're blue, and they have some of the rings on the side. Yeah, this one. Oh, I got this one. What is this one? Yeah, she's oh, burnt Santa. Oh, that's black. Yeah, that's one. 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 They got the Fenty section in here. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Do they have all my own things in here? Look at one of the Fenty. Of course they wouldn't have the uncensored. Is this a gloss? Long wear fluid. Oh, yeah. I might just have to use the eyeliner. Because I don't see a lip liner that I need. Alright, y'all. Let's look at some lash lashes. Let's see what they got. I like the kiss, but I don't know about these kiss ones. They like kiss lashes. Those are my go-to. But these ones are like too thin. Like the um the band on it is too thin so i don't like that they have ones like these but these are 15 dollars so um you know i think i got some at home okay, okay y'all this is how the cart is looking i got some snacks for them and then i got some stuff that we needed for the house but I've been seeing these and I do actually want to try these one day. 
but not today. What we gonna try? I went right past the Gatorade. That's what I was looking for, Gatorade. Okay. Mm, I don't even know what flavor to get, I guess. Drinks for the twins. We could just drink some apple juice, honestly. And these are cute. To create a lit pumpkin, add battery operated lights. Oh, you gotta put them inside. Okay. And this one is cute. How does this one smell? It actually don't smell bad. I can't tell me this bowl is not the no cutest. Oh my gosh. Is it black? Oh, yes, it's black. I like this. I'm getting this. And I like this one too. <coughs> this bowl is too cute. I don't think I'm going to get this one though because I really don't use bowls too much. Mm, I like this one. I'll get this one. Is it green or is it? Because I don't look green, kind of. I think it's black. Yeah, it's black. I want to say black right there. Okay, I'm out of there, y'all. Let me tell y'all what just happened, though. So somebody... Let me cover my license, please. Somebody just left this on my door, right? Found a debit card. I don't know if y'all can read it because it might be backwards. I might, I'm going to flip it. Find a debit card by your door to, to customer service. And they wrote my license plate. And they put it inside my door. So I went to... But it's crazy because... It was on my passenger side and I didn't get out on that side. So, unless they just put it on that side, but they said by my door, I don't know. But I went to customer service and when I gave her my name, she said that wasn't the name that was on the card. I don't know, but she wouldn't show me the card because I guess she didn't want me to try to say that it was my car and it wasn't my car. I wish she would have showed me the card because I'm like, what if it was like, the, I don't know. I don't know. But um, I looked to see if I was missing any cards and I wasn't. So, But I have a lot of cards, y'all. You know how like you just have a lot of cards? I have a lot of cards. But I gave her my name. We'll go. But I gave her my name and she said that she, um, it wasn't that name. And she was like, she they be having people do that. And then they come to customer service. And then there's nothing there. But I was showing y'all that video of them now saying that you gotta have under 10 items to use customer service. I mean, to use self checkout because I always use self checkout. No matter how many things I have, I use self checkout because I just like to ring up my own stuff. But I guess they're doing that because people aren't ringing up their stuff. <laughs> like I told y'all in the last vlog, when somebody got caught stealing. But. I like to use it because like even today the man that was ringing me up it's just like he was just so like not caring about if my stuff got taken off because they had a lot of stuff in there oh wait it did 20% off when I use my gift card for the other stuff that I bought the makeup stuff he didn't let me like by the time I gave him the gift card and he didn't even allow me to give him my target circle thing that's why i like to ring up my own stuff because i can make sure that is what it is you know what i'm saying like he just was trying to hurry up and get out of there he and that's what he said too he was like i'm just trying to make the time go by quicker but yeah i'm kind of upset that i can't do stuff check out anymore but i guess they're trying to do that to cut down on people on theft shoplifters yeah but all right y'all i'm on my way back home Okay, you guys so i should have included the uh get ready with me in this video oh this lighting is horrible hold on wait let me get outside <laughs> okay i think my purse is in the car hello hi who money you got in your hand who money you got in your hand madden who money you got 
up? What up? What's up, G? What's up? This seems, this seems like such some alcoholic vibes, but... <laughs> I promise y'all, after the night, I'm not drinking for a while. Excuse this light over me, but um, we're going to try this tonight. This is what Trail bought, salted caramel crown oil. I never had it. It says limited edition, so maybe they can bring it out when it's like fall. If I can get it, y'all. These damn nails, man. It's smooth, man. Trail, man. Oh, even as shot, you know it. That's a double shot. Of, it is. I look like a double shot. Double shot. Where y'all get these little so amazing things from? Big I like glass. this. Nah, man, you call me poor these shot glasses? Yes, yeah, like, you see it say shot. Give oh, it okay. <laughs> Cheers. I'm not going to drink no more. Ooh, I, it smells sweet, Lord. You still drink, see? You want the can. I don't take the kill, but I like, We gotta take one more than four. Jesus. <laughs> My battery is already on 3%. Why? 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 Thank you. 
trying to um get my radio fixed but it's not the fuses so i don't know the radio might got to be taken apart but i don't know if y'all remember me telling y'all about the lights inside my car stopped working years ago so it was the lights it was the clock inside my car and the remote control that lets me unlock and lock the car back and pop the trunk and stuff all of that stopped working at the same time so my dad changed the fuses but it still didn't work so he was just out there changing everything and he just so happened to change all the fuses because he was like you know let me just change them all and y'all it started working i was so excited do y'all know how long it's been since i had lights inside my car since i've been able to tell the time inside my car without looking at my phone and been able to unlock and lock my door but in the meantime, while I'm out there, I burnt my pizza. But I'm about to see if it's truly burnt, burnt, or if it's just look burnt. <laughs> hey, y'all. It's a little bit later. It's 5 o'clock. Um... I'm about to go to the grocery, my hands are ashy, but I have this oil. <laughs> Tonight for dinner, I decided to cook borilla tacos. Y'all know the tacos where you dip in the consomme sauce. But y'all, let me show y'all this list, honey. Because I said, if I get in this grocery store, 
and they don't have some of this stuff we i'm not going to the grocery store the grocery store we just gonna have to eat something different because i'm gonna show y'all this list of stuff like literally y'all it take up my whole note thing because i wrote it down this time because i don't know i like to write stuff down more than i like to put it in my phone it's just i don't know it's just something i write in pen and paper but do y'all see all this this is the list of stuff that i need this so i'm trying to cook this with, with uh mexican rice so yeah <laughs> this is a lot of stuff and some of this stuff i never even heard of so i might need some help in there but we just gonna do what we do what we do it okay um dang Ugh, i'm gonna have to put my wallet in my shirt because i ain't got the pockets and i already gotta look at this long list of stuff i ain't got time to be keeping up my wallet all right y'all come on y'all one thing about me and I, I realized that it's because so I, I, I was like reading a numerology book before and I don't know if y'all into numerology but it's like everything from now to your birthday the what day your birthday falls on the date of your birthday your, your birth month the time all of that plays a factor in how you are as a person so when I was like studying myself before it said that I don't like tedious things and that is so correct. I do not like tedious stuff. When it come down to like if somebody is having an event, I'm not that person that want to help clean up and I, baby, what time do the party start? Okay? And I'm going to be gone before y'all start breaking down cuz I don't want to help. And <laughs> like that's how I am like even when it come down to my own stuff, I just do not like tedious stuff. So for this 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 paper girl please but i'm trying something new so we're gonna see <laughs> i'm really pouting on my way into this grocery store why is the list so long so i'm gonna go up here and i forgot my pen so three pounds on this check Okay, so turmeric, thyme, sesame, rosemary, rosemary, curry. Ooh. I know I need garlic salt, but I'm trying to get everything in order, y'all. But I got my pan. You see rosemary. I see ground cumin up there. I don't see no cumin seeds. And I feel like they have it, but I just feel like I'm not seeing it. Coriander seeds. I ain't seen nothing in here that say no dig or coriander. What the hell? What does that look like? Coriander? Oh, I gotta go that. Hold on. Like, is there any other section that just saw that? Like, what? And this is stuff that I probably would never do again. I'm gonna put you there. But. I know I need that. I know I need cinnamon sticks. I also need bay leaves. But I do not see no dead old coriander. Cause I did see that body up. It was like in a bag like this. I 
don't see it up here. I don't know. Y'all think I'm upset? No. Because <laughs> guess what? Like I said, I don't like doing tedious stuff anyway. But I do want to cook it one day. So we just going to have to come back and revisit that when we get the chance. I probably do an order off of Amazon for the ingredients because I did see that they have the ingredients on Amazon. And you know, Amazon does. Um, let me put my seatbelt on. I think I might cook chicken alfredo, but I was trying not to cook pasta because we ate baked ziti earlier this week. And even though we do like pasta, I really only be cooking pasta like once a week. So being that we cooked baked ziti earlier this week, I really wasn't trying to cook no chicken alfredo. But I already have all of the ingredients for the chicken alfredo in the refrigerator because I was going to cook it the other night, but I just decided not to. Um... But I want to um, start expanding my dinner, like different variety of things, because we eat the same things over and over and over again every week. And it's to me, it's because the kids don't like to eat a variety of stuff like they just don't like to eat certain things. They don't like onions, you know, you know the typical stuff. And I understand it because I was like that, too. But now that I'm older, my palate has expanded. But yeah it's just like didn't close it out last night but I wanted to tell y'all um because I don't think I ever gave my review on the Kevin Gates concert so Kevin Gates I was such a huge fan of his I think because like I love his voice <laughs> really but then eventually he did start doing too much I'm like you just doing a little bit too much but you know what I'm saying? It was never a point where I was like, oh, I just wouldn't go to his concert. But like after going to his concert and then like comparing it to the 50 Cent concert, because I told y'all I haven't been to concert in years. So those are the two concerts that I went to recently. But after going to the 50 Cent concert and then comparing it to Kevin Gates concert, it was just completely different. My neighbor is staring me right in my face. So with Kevin Gates, he was like, first of all, he took a long time to come out. And then when he was changing outfits, it was like so awkward because it was just like such a long time between 
sets I guess and it's not even like the outfits that he was changing to was something major I well at the 50 cent concert and not trying to compare them to but that's you know say all I can do is compare at the 50 cents concert y'all he changed his outfit so quick that my mama was like there's no way that that's him that's not him that's not him that's a clone because it literally was seconds like literally you wouldn't even see him leave the stage that's how quick it was that he was just changing his outfits and I feel like that he really like kept the crowd entertained kept the crowd um you know what I'm saying present and even though I didn't know a lot of his songs shoot I felt like I knew every song that's how engaging it was but at the Kevin Gates concert it just wasn't given that at all um on top of that I feel like he knows that he's not a good entertainer so because he's not a good entertainer well let me say he's not a good performer to me and because he's not a good performer I feel like that he tried to overcompensate for the things that he do. So he asked the girl to come on stage, which is going viral now, y'all, on social media. I knew it was because I was like, somebody gonna get that on camera. And I'm just waiting for the moment where they figure out what her Instagram name is or YouTube or something or Facebook or something so I can go look her up because I would be going into hiding. But he asked somebody to come on stage and he asked her several times like, can I do anything to you? Anything, anything. And she said, yeah. And um, so, because she said that that's when he set her down and spit in her mouth and i just feel like you know we all know that kevin gates is married but we really don't know what's going on between their relationship because we have seen him come out with different women and yeah, yeah, yeah. but for one you married you have kids not only that just as a woman like why would you get on stage and let somebody spit in your mouth and i know that some people that's something that they're into with their person that they you know are engaged with sexually but I feel like it's one thing you're doing it with somebody that you're with and it's one thing you're doing it with Kevin Gates just because he's Kevin Gates. Like, yes, it's Kevin Gates, but we don't know what he was doing with his mom. And that's just nasty. So, I ain't like that he did that because it's like, why would you? I feel like he was just trying to overcompensate for a sorry, act, sorry, a sorry show. And I believe that was his first show on tour, honestly. Which I was kind of surprised that he went to Virginia for his first tour, but whatever. That was the update on the Kevin Gates concert. Then after that, we had went to go eat at Ruth Chris but we end up leaving Ruth Chris because they said that they were only selling appetizers so we end up going to Wawa so that was the end of that night and then yesterday as far as the chicken alfredo y'all I'm so glad that I used the fried chicken instead of grilled they were saying that they want me to use the fried chicken from now on instead of grilled because it just tasted much better um in, in my opinion it did too now the presentation wasn't as nice as the grilled chicken to me because like the grilled chicken I usually mix it up inside the chicken alfredo but the fried chicken I really didn't want to too much because I don't like when my bread or my chicken gets soft so that's why I didn't do that but it was good I really I really enjoyed that meal um and I y'all saw I used my cute target bowl <laughs> but I'm actually about to just I'm actually about to just sit out here and drink my coffee and um my neighbors are doing the absolute what time is well it is 10 30 that's not too late but they out here running around and stuff and it's not like it's kids it's adults like what are y'all doing i'm about to sit out here and watch i might be about to sit out here because this sun is beaming right on my face and usually it's not beaming like this but then again i don't be sitting out here 10 30. i usually be out here early but um anyway y'all being that today is Sunday, I'm going to really use this day to get the house together for one. Get everything together, like plan stuff for the week, y'all. Because, yeah, I got to get my life together. Like, I haven't been doing right. But I'll talk about that in the next vlog. Okay. I love you guys. Bye.